Hello, my name is John Murray with the MurrayGroup.biz of Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate. I will be your host today. Here we're walking up to the front of this home. As you notice, this has a newer concrete driveway that leads all the way back to our huge two-car garage here. Covered front porch, and that will have new indoor outdoor or excuse me i guess that's just outdoor carpet driveway even has a brick paver leading to the back and a really neat backyard here we do have a small covered uh, back porch here and we can't see it with the snow here but these are little gardens and all kinds of vegetation and then we even have this big storage shed here that doubles as another covered patio and this is all pavers out here and then this is a deck and this is all covered so the storage shed they can store all of your furniture so a great little gathering area here uh, the roof on the lower section here has been updated we have a train furnace and air conditioner have been updated great house turnkey ready price to sell we're gonna go inside and take a look so here I just came through the front door and we're greeted by a spacious living room to our left is where we go up the stairs. There are three bedrooms and one full bathroom up there. The homeowner tells me that there is hardwood floors or wood floors, I should say, underneath the carpet. Large coat closet here with the original door. And then most of the windows, if not all of the windows, have been updated. These are double pane glass vinyl windows. That's the dining room that we're peering into there. This is the living room, and the old wood-burning fireplace was converted to gas. Then walking into the dining room, these are double glass doors, French doors that open into the dining room. We have a chandelier with crown molding in here. We have the corner cabinet for your dinnerware. Now one thing that's different with this home, and I'll show this to you last, we do have a first floor bathroom which is very, very nice. You do not have to go upstairs to use the bathroom, but we're looking at the kitchen right now. Plenty of cabinets, all of the appliances do stay. And we have an eat at breakfast bar here, or breakfast peninsula, I should say. Now this is all an addition back here. We're calling this the fourth bedroom to the home. We do have the closet over here. And this is not indicative of the typical house that you would get in this neighborhood. And then here is our half bathroom, which is very nice. Don't have to track up the stairs. You even have a built-in linen closet here. So that's the first floor. The entrance to the second floor we saw when we came in. And then the entrance to the basement is over here. And there is a back door right here. And that is a brand, well not brand new, but updated door with the slim shade system in between the panes of glass and there is also a side door over here we'll check out the basement later let's go upstairs and take a look at the second floor i'll meet you upstairs all right so here i just came to the top of the stairs we're greeted by a good sized landing in here immediately to our left upon coming up the stairs is the full bathroom and check out the size of this bathroom it is humongous this is the most built-ins that i've seen in a bathroom in a very very long time Look at the size of all of this stuff. Bathtub and, ba and surround are both in good shape. Commode looks newer here. Nice vanity, nice medicine cabinet. Gorgeous, gorgeous bathroom. Bedroom number one, closet is over here and that is a huge closet in there. Has a uh, storage above like the staircase where they're just maximizing. That's the smallest of the three bedrooms. And bedroom number two, this is on the front right of the home, if you're looking at it from the street. Here's a good look at the doors. Solid doors. And then here is bedroom number three. One thing I like, the ceiling fans in each room really help cut down with the energy bills. Next, I'll meet you down in the basement, and we'll take a look down there. So here I just came down the stairs. The basement's broken up into two areas. Behind this desk, it looks like they're used to be possibly a lower level fireplace down here, but the basement is partially finished. So it's drywall in the ceilings here and looks like uh, area rugs on the floor, but this was used mainly for storage, but could be converted into a family room. 
give you another perspective here. Then the second room kind of opens up into a utility room slash storage room. Looks like we have a updated breaker box over there. The washer and dryer do stay with the home. Here's our water heater. Looks to be in very good shape. And there's our updated newer train furnace with a matching train air conditioner on there as well. And coming around the corner, we have underneath the stairs storage here. And a lot of the plumbing, the duct work, there's been a lot of updates on this home. It's a great space down here. Next, I'll meet you back upstairs for a few closing statements. So thanks for watching our video of this lovely home. Again, this is not a foreclosure. It is not a short sale. This is a move-in ready home that is priced to sell. So give me a call today. Again, my name is John Murray with murraygroup.biz of Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate. I can be reached at area code 937-654-7355 or by email. That is john, J-O-N, at buywithjohn.com. That's B-U-I-W-I-T-H-J-O-N.com. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to talking to you.